Hey, it's Scott from New Garden Road. I just wanted to give you some quick tips for growing squash in your fall garden. Are you afraid of the squash vine borer and its wrath? Well, you won't have to worry about it if you cover your plants up with some insect netting. This is a perfect organic approach, but I will say once your squash plants start flowering vigorously with both male and female flowers, you'll have to make a choice. Will you uncover them? Take your chances? Will you hand pollinate? The next tip is to provide your squash plants with enough moisture. We're really warm here in Central Texas, pushing 100 degrees. I've got shade cloth on top. It's not uncommon for squash plants to wilt during the middle of a hot day, so make sure you check that soil first and give them a long deep watering as opposed to a shallow one. You also want to keep your squash plants fed. I like to go with the Neptune's Harvest Fish Fertilizer, Soluble Seaweed Powder, and the Rev Humic Acids. I apply that as a soil drench on a weekly basis. You really want them to launch into the season and grow vigorously. Make sure you keep an eye on your squash plants. Check them daily if you're able to. Check the leaves, the stems, and you'll be on top of things as they come up. Keep it organic.